How's it going movie fans? The 15th of July 2023 is the 62nd birthday of director, producer and actor Forrest Whitaker. A BAFTA, Golden Globe and an Academy Award winner, Whitaker's on-screen acting debut came with television and feature film appearances in 1982, and by the end of the 1980s he had already cemented himself as a huge talent and has delivered with a fantastic career. Whitaker currently has five projects in production, including Havoc, which is due for release later in 2023. Here are the Firewall's top 10 Forrest Whitaker movies. At number 10, is Fast Times at Ridgemont High. Whitaker's first notable film role came in this coming-of-age comedy, in which he plays Charles Jefferson, one of the star football players at Ridgemont High, who loves his 1981 Chevrolet Camaro, but Jefferson's younger brother, along with carefree stoner Jeff Spicoli, take it for a joyride. The round has 90 minutes, and Fast Times at Ridgemont High has the firewall rating of 7.6 out of 10. At number 9, is The Colour of Money. In this sports drama, based on the novel of the same name, and a sequel to 1961's The Hustler, Whitaker plays Amos, a pool shark who plays former pool hustler Eddie Felson in a game. Meanwhile, Felson takes the promising Vincent Laurier under his wing and teaches him the art of pool hustling. The round has 19 minutes, and The Colour of Money has the foul rating of 7.7. .7. At number 8, is Smoke. In this comedy drama, Whitaker plays Cyrus Cole, who is tracked down by his son Thomas, aka Rashid. The pair have been estranged since Rashid was a child, so Rashid conceals his identity upon meeting his father. This leads to Cyrus befriending Rashid and hiring him to work at a gas station. The round time is on 12 minutes, and Smoke has the foal rating of 7.7. .7. At number 7 is Rebound, The Legend of El the Goat Manigault. This made-for-TV movie is based on the life of El Manigault, who looked set to be destined for fame and fortune with his talent for basketball, but who struggles with drug addiction and criminal behaviour. Whitaker plays Holcomb Rucker, Manigault's mentor and a playground director in Harlem. The run time is on 20 minutes, and Rebound, The Legend of El the Goat Manigault has the foul rating of 7.8. At number 6, is Ghost Dog, The Way of the Samurai. In this crime drama, Whitaker plays the character known as Ghost Dog, a hitman working for the Mafia. He lives strictly by the code of the samurai, but when a job he is sent on doesn't go quite according to plan, Ghost Dog becomes the target of the mob himself. This puts him on the defensive while trying to stay true to his code. The round time is 116 minutes, and Ghost Dog, The Way of the Samurai has the foul rating of 7.8. At number 5, is Black Panther. In the 18th film in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, Whitaker plays Zuri, an elder statesman of the fictional nation of Wakanda, and the keeper of the heart-shaped herb, which when ingested gives the power of the Black Panther. T'Challa is crowned king of Wakanda, but a mysterious contender for the throne appears. The run time is 34 minutes, and Black Panther has a foul rating of 7.9. At number 4 is The Last King of Scotland. Whitaker won a BAFTA, a Golden Globe and an Academy Award for his performance as General Idi Amin in this biographical drama based on the novel of the same name. In the 1970s, Amin overthrows the incumbent Ugandan president and develops a friendship with Nicholas Garrigan who is working at a missionary clinic. The run time is 23 minutes and The Last King of Scotland has a viral rating of 8. At number 3 is Rogue One, A Star Wars Story. Prior to the events of Star Wars Episode IV A New Hope, the Rebel Alliance must acquire the plans to the Death Star if they are to stand a chance defeating the Empire and Darth Vader. Whitaker plays Saw Gerrera, a veteran of the Clone Wars, and a mentor to Jin Erso, who sets out to steal the plans. The run time is 33 minutes, and Rogue One A Star Wars Story has a foal rating of 8.1. At number 2 is Arrival. In this sci-fi drama, Louise Banks is a linguist who is paid a visit by US Army Colonel G.T. Weber, played by Whitaker, and invited to study one of a group of alien spacecraft which are hovering above numerous locations around the world. Banks is needed to open communication with the aliens to find out their intentions. The run time is on 16 minutes, and Arrival has the foul rating of 8.5. At number 1, is Platoon. Set in 1967 during the Vietnam War, soldier Chris Taylor, who is stationed in South Vietnam, is pushed to his limit when he is faced with the questionable conduct of his fellow soldiers and superiors. Whitaker plays Big Harold, a US Army Private First Class of the US 25th Infantry Division. The run time is on 20 minutes and Platoon has the foul rating of 8.8. .8. Thanks for watching, next week I'll be counting down the foul's top 10 Willem Dafoe movies, and if you enjoyed this list, please don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe.